all right guys um so it's chizuki stanley here so in this video i'm going to be showing you how you can um, translate the 1688 app okay using the high dictionary okay if you look closely here this is the high dictionary if you don't have it go to play store and download it for those for android users go to play store and you download your high dictionary i know a lot of us have challenge in translating the 1688 app okay so now this app is going to be helpful download the high dictionary so after downloading it um the next thing you're going to do here is to um set up the app so you could be able to use it so it cannot display on our phone on the screen of our phone okay so now let's go straight to that we'll click on it this is the high dictionary we do the necessary setup here before we proceed okay quick translate set permission we allow it to display over other apps that's the first thing you do here we go back then we click on set permission again oh i need to be showing us all this set permission so now this is set permission below here you click on it right so once you click on it, it takes us to this next page you just click on any section on the screen here we can get it so now this is the most important part of it we need to give your high dictionary permission okay we give it permission so it could work properly um whatever device you're using just give the high dictionary the um the permission to display so what i'm going to do in this case here i'm going to click on download okay then i'll give it accessibility click on allow i think that is it go back and um we have return back here um we click on um quick translate so we can change it to from chinese change this hindu to chinese language okay chinese language hope i'm not past okay this is it here click on it chinese if this is off you click here to on it okay as you can see it's off you can just tap it it changes to to on okay this is what i mean it has to change to um sorry it has to change to on before we could use it um let me show you what i mean this is it this on if it's not showing you on make sure you set it up by clicking on this by clicking on this section to get it on right so um after you must have done that i think we are good to go as you can see here um it's been shown here this is it some it's been displayed at the side of the screen okay that is the high dictionary being displayed on our phone screen so the next thing we're going to do We'll go to whatever Chinese sites we want to translate. We'll just go there and then um, we start translating the page to understand everything here. Okay. You see on this app, most of what is written on this app are in Chinese languages because it's designed for domestic purposes, just like our Jumia here in Nigeria. This is designed in Chinese languages. Okay. So we need apps to be able to, to translate this, unlike um the side version where um the chrome browser helps us to translate it okay but in this case we can use the chrome browser here okay so now to translate this page we click on this um high dictionary icon here this high dictionary action icon here once you click on it it's going to give us this okay so when you give us this we click sorry um click on it again I think I have to cancel this. I click on High Dictionary. It gives us some couple of options here. So there are two ways we can go about this. We can click on Global Translation. Once you click on Global Translation, it's going to scan the page to translate it to English. Okay. So it's scanning the page now. <coughs> Sorry. So as you can see, it's giving us English here, but though some of the pages are not translating. But once you just tap on the screen, the translation will change back to English language. It's just as if it's screenshotting the page, then translating it. That is what it's doing here. So once you touch the page here, it changes back to 
to Chinese language. So now, for you to get more details about any product, you just go straight and click on the product. Click on the product, okay? Um, let's wait for it to load. Okay, so um, we come over here. Sorry. We come over here. We click on the product, okay? Click on the product. So let me cancel this. We we'll click on this high dictionary icon here. You can still click on global translation. Okay, it's going to scan the page again. You see it? Although there are some features that are not shown here clearly. But as soon as you touch the screen, it changes back to the Chinese. So now here is one of the way I normally use. It's the easiest, and I think most of you will love to use it. Okay, I will click on this screen. The high dictionary icon again i'll click on move so when i click on move i'll just move it it gives me a kind of a search bar which i can use to search on anything i want to read as you can see now it's giving us the english version okay new foreign trade human bag as you can see it's been translated let me take it over to this side and see if it gives us a translation this express fee that is the logistic fee shipping fee local shipping fee sorry see this changes within seconds let's check over here next one it changes some products in the shops can be purchased in mixed badges okay as you can see it changes this is the name of the store changes so uh to me just let me know if this is helpful if you prefer this method to the first one other now as you can see it's it's translating it separately for us and to me i feel this is more helpful than the second one than the first one rather move i'll drag it it changes to the search icon see here fast refund lost goods must be compensated 24 hours delivery services wow this is lovely this is lovely guys this is one of the way you could be able to use in translating the app okay um and i believe uh, this video is it's helpful okay and um if you really love this video and um you you would want to see more of similar videos like this okay please kindly subscribe if you've not done that okay and um hit the like button and then uh, also turn up your notification bell so you could actually get or you could be the first to view our videos whenever we drop them okay all right so guys see you in the next video bye